I'd just like to congratulate Regis. They played a great game. Uh, they're a worthy RMAC tournament champion. Uh, they're on a great streak right now. They, they played better than we did tonight. So tip my hat to them. Uh, I told my guys in the locker room there's nothing we need to be hanging our heads about. We've had an awesome year, uh, regular season championship, 16-1 uh, and one home record, uh, fought, th fought through the, the, the rigorous RMAC schedule, uh, and we're a champion ourselves. Uh, we'll get back to practice on Monday and look forward to the real season, which is the NCAA regional, uh, and, and see if we can't make a run in the regional. Yeah, you know, it's hard to beat a team three times, especially a team as good as Regis. Um, there was really nothing different. They played better than we did tonight. We tip our hat. Um, that was just the difference. Broadbeck was very good. He made shots. We didn't make enough shots. We missed some free throws. But uh, that sport, it's, it was, it's a 40-minute game. They had more points than us in the 40 minutes. They're very well coached. Uh, they're a very, very good team, NCAA regional team, and there's a chance that we might even play them in the first round of the regional next week. So uh, we just need to stay together as a group, uh, understand uh, that one loss isn't going to define our season. We've had a special season. Anytime you can win a championship ring in this, uh, in this league, it's been a special year, and we're just going to keep moving forward. Uh, fortunately for us, uh, come Sunday, the selection show tomorrow, everybody starts their season 0-0, uh, and it's a race for six games. So we're 0-0 starting tomorrow morning. I've just been doing what I've been doing since I got to Fort Lewis. You know, the coaches instill a ton of confidence in me and let me play my game. And, you know, unfortunately, like Coach said, Regis was just the better team tonight. They uh, had a little more energy than us in the beginning, and you could see they jumped out to that lead. And... Uh, I don't know, in terms of my performance, I I need to be better. I had two in and out threes that I wish I could get back. They felt great leaving my hand. The Wayland rims just weren't on my side tonight. So, you know, and the coaches in terms of rebounding have been preaching that all year, and I just tried to do what I can. Let me just say a couple of things about Rasmus Bach before we move on. A uh, young man goes 46-2 and two in this building the last three years, uh, leaves Wayland Gymnasium as the winningest player in Fort Lewis history. Uh, regardless of his performance uh, in any game, he's going to go down as one of the best players that's ever played here. Uh, and I hope our crowd uh, enjoyed him the last four years as much as I have and has his best basketball ahead of him next week in Texas. It was just pretty much just doing anything I could do to help my team out. Uh, and uh, Just trying to respond to um, the re Regis, um, just tough buckets they're hitting. And, uh, just finding a way to stay involved on the court, if, I, if anything, um, Hustling, poking balls out, getting loose balls, rebounding. Uh, you know, we just—they were the better team, man. I just did what I wanted. Um, I think it takes a little bit of a toll, but in this league, you play back to back. You just gotta be man enough. I mean, I had a dead leg, and Quell had a bruised knee, and DJ has a bruised calf. But hey, Regis has injuries too. I'm sure. So. Now, we were a little banged up tonight, but that doesn't take away from Regis's performance. But listen, uh, last night was a rivalry game, and, and it was a very good game, and they were big and strong. And we were a little tired tonight uh, and, and a little shorthanded uh, with some of the bumps and bruises, especially with Ferris uh, being, being less than 100%. So it uh, doesn't take away from Regis. But we just got to get back. Uh, we'll get back to practice uh, and get going. Anytime you lose, uh, you got to look in the mirror, but I, I'm just really proud of our team. Uh, not only tonight, and we, we've had five seniors uh, on this team that have been championship people, and they've stuck in there. And it hasn't all, you know, when you when you win the league, it, it isn't all sunshine and rainbows. There's been peaks and valleys to this thing, um, but we've always stuck together. And I, I'm proud of the guys' effort, even tonight. We didn't play great. Uh, but I don't think it was an effort thing. I think we were given everything we had. It just in sports sometimes it doesn't the ball doesn't bounce your way, and that's okay. Uh, in terms of Brandon, he does everything right yeah. on the court all the yeah. time. We, I've never had an issue with him, and I don't know if he's ever had an issue with anyone else on this team. He's just a great friend and a great basketball player. Best defensive big I've ever played. With, just solid. It just makes me want to work hard and just uh, get better with them, man. Because I see what we're capable of. So it's just. Uh, making me realize what we're capable of, and I just know, so. Well, we're very proud of our program, and it's been built for a long time, and um, we've had a lot of great players come through, really quality people, um, and we'll continue that next week. 
Uh, this is not our season's not over. Everybody needs to understand that. Uh, we're going to be one of the 64 teams that got one of the golden tickets to keep playing, and we plan on doing that. Uh, as far as Fort Lewis basketball moving forward, we plan on playing in more of these. No. no I, I don't know that. I just, hey, we're going to get seeded. Probably will be a, probably a top four or five seed, and whoever we play will be ready to play. So that's it. It doesn't matter. I mean, every team in the region out of, out of those eight teams is going to be a, a tough, tough game. They all deserve to be there. And would I like to play Regis again? Sure. But, I mean, I don't care. I'm just I'm very blessed to have been able to get to three championship games and uh, just blessed to be able to continue playing with Fort Lewis on my, on my chest.